creatine peptides. What's unique about our, our creatine peptide, it is essentially binding amino acids to peptides isolated from whey. It's designed to improve solubility as well as delivery and uptake. The other added benefit of it is that uh, whey peptides are known to increase insulin. Insulogenic response can also further enhance, making sure you are really getting the most, most of it. The creatine, is, it's, it's not about just muscle. But what it's really doing, it's increasing your body's primary energy source. So it's, help, it's helping replenish uh, adenosine triphosphate, also known as ATP. ATP is something that, uh, you know, gets depleted rather quickly. And when you replenish it, you can see greater increases in power, greater increases, especially in muscle energy contractions. And that can lead to those performance gains. At the same time, it is really good for glycogen replenishment. The benefits of creatine, it's typically really, really effective in those like short, intense, rapid movements. So think that 30 to 45 seconds, uh, ideally. And we're talking about, uh, so, you know, weight training, sprints, but all those types of power movements where it's extremely effective. We know now that it's helping with brain, cognitive health, bone health is, is something not just for people in the gym. So when people are stressed, sleep deprived, that's definitely me to, to some extent. To anyone who has young kids, I've got two young kids. I noticeably feel better uh, when I take creatine uh, consistently. So I do notice that because your brain's using 20% of your body's energy in terms of ATP. So when you're tired, you're not in that ideal state, you need to be taking creatine. So I strongly, strongly recommend it. Something that's really, really, really helped me, helps me as someone who, who's who got a you know a demanding job. I love my job, but it can also, um, you know, there's a lot to do there. And uh, with kids, family, balancing all that and staying active, maintaining ideal physical and mental health. Strongly recommend that. Uh, typical maintenance dose, that I would say is a minimum of uh, five and then try to get up to 10 uh, to just get all the additional benefits in terms of uh, the brain and uh, the muscle.